All right, everybody, here we are for some strength training. Let's go ahead and just get warmed up. Start with rotations. Reach across, spread the fingers. Over. Press down, heel touch. Reach up. Both hands across. Up and over. And roll the hips around. Other direction. Okay, so we're going to start with the band. And you can have a seat. We're going to do chest press. What we're going to do is a little bit of basic movement followed by some little more intensity movement of the same muscles. So we'll start with chest press, pinch up a little higher and pressing out. So nice and slow on the way back. Good, and then we're gonna do this. We're gonna do a toe touch to the side, reach across, but the same arm and a little faster. Try the other side. Good, and then we go back to just pressing. Last two. Good, and then one more time on this. Press, touch. So I'm just stepping out slightly, pressing with that arm. Other side. Excellent, and then wrap up the legs. So we go underneath first, over the top, and make it tight, out and in. Good, relax on that for a second. About 10 seconds and make it kind of tight again. We're gonna go out and in faster now. Keep the feet fairly close together. I know you can't quite see me there. 
And faster, out and in. And relax. Rest for 10 seconds. And now we go out and in. Nice and slow. We can have the feet out further on this one. And that ought to be good enough for that muscle. Let's go down uh, underneath the feet. So put your band underneath those feet. Make sure it's solid under there. And we're gonna cross the handles, throwing it right back to those hips. Good, then we're gonna alternate sides, but just do the one side first. I guess that's not alternating, but we're gonna do one side first. Five more. Good, other side, 10 of them. One, two, look behind you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and relax. Rest for 10 seconds. All right, good posture. About ready to do another round of rowing. Here we go. This way you'll work the muscles a little more in each area. Good, all right, then we go one side. All right, other side, we'll do 12, one. And relax, good. Let's go ahead and take the band out of there. Stand on up, grab your weights. We're gonna do calves next. Let's use these for a little added weight. We go up to the balls of the feet. So go down really slow, really working those calves on this one. Good, and then stretch. You can just kind of put one leg back, hold on if you need to. Lean into it. And other side. Okay, here we go. This time what we're gonna do is press and calf raise at the same time. Up, up, pretty fast. Do your best. Almost there, five more. And relax. Good, just rest for about 10 seconds. We're gonna do some lat raises next. So all you're gonna do is go out, working your shoulders. More for strength this time. One more and relax. So rest those shoulders, go up to the balls of the feet again, nice and slow on the way down.
Keep going. Give me about five more of those, nice and slow on the way down. Good, and then go back to these shoulder raises, 10 of them. Good, and you get ready for your calf raise and your presses. Going up pretty fast here and begin. Couple more and relax. Good, go ahead and set your weights down. We're gonna do lunges next. We're actually uh, squats and lunges together. So we're going to work the muscles here first by doing some really good squats, nice and slow. Five more. Excellent. So now we're going to do lunges stepping forward. So we're just going to, you can have the chair close by actually over here. I'm just going to step, have a pretty good distance, come down and up. So this can be a little faster this time, but just be careful. Don't hurt the knees. You gotta have pretty good form if you're going faster. And it could just be stepping forward and back. Make it simple. A little bit of a knee bend. Just getting the heart rate up a little bit too. Couple more. And relax. Good, just rest for about 10 seconds. Let your heart rate come down, and then we'll go back to those squats again. So doing some stable stuff with some more higher intensity, unstable. It's kind of the idea. Here we go, squats. Try to sit back with it. Don't let your knees go forward. We got four more to go here. Excellent. All right, give yourself a rest and then we're gonna do those lunges again. Remember, we're gonna step pretty deep on these when we do them. So have some distance. All right, begin. So this is a little faster. Work your balance a little bit. Last two. Excellent. All right, let's go ahead and have a seat. So that's about it for that kind of stuff. We're going to get into some chest pressing now. Uh, go ahead and get your weights out. And we're going to sit down, relax, and sit back, working your chest press. So we'll kind of double up on some of these exercises now. Five more. 
So we did some chest already. This is a little extra. And next is the row. So we're gonna lean forward and go in like this, raising it up. Good, now put your hands here and just push it back. Working triceps, moving just at the elbow. Last two. Good, next is biceps, going like this, just opening up, curling up. About five more. And then we go back to triceps. So you lean forward, hands at your sides, just push it back. Last two. Good, and then put both weights in one hand, side bends. Last two. Good, other side. Inhale side, exhale when you crunch. Five more. Excellent. So let's sit forward and we'll do some ab crunches just forward and back. Inhale back, exhale forward. Five more. All right, good. Let's go ahead and march it out a little bit. Heavy march. Excellent. Let's go ahead and stand up and work on some balance. You can go ahead and drop the weights. And we're going to do a tree pose, kind of like a yoga thing. Just having your foot turned out, coming to heart center, and just taking about two or three deep breaths, holding for about 30 seconds.
Good, let's try the other side. One more breath. And relax. Go ahead and reach up, take a couple deep breaths. And then we have airplane pose. A little yoga finish here. Take a couple deep breaths. And relax, rotate a little bit. We're gonna do another balance here. It's basically warrior three, but we're gonna move through it. So we're here and we're gonna just reach out like we're gonna to touch the chair and then come back. You could even touch the back of the chair like so, and then back. Also called drinking bird sometimes. Let's do two more, I'll be 10. And just uh, watch your balance. You don't wanna, you don't wanna hurt yourself. Try the other side. No falling. That's why we got this chair here, just in case. Two more. And relax. Good, let's go ahead and have a seat. We're gonna stretch out here, put your right leg out. Take a deep breath in. Let's stretch the back of your leg there. Ease into it, work your breathing. Go a little further. All right, rotate your ankle. Other direction. And point and flex. And other leg out, deep breath in. All right, rotate that ankle. Other direction. Point and flex.
and then face this direction. One leg back, reach up. And then we'll go the other direction. And back to center, twisting, looking behind you. And other side. Speed up a little bit, push out and curve your back. And then we go to one side, take a deep breath in. And other side. And then we cross the legs. And the other side. Next is triceps. <clears throat> And the other side. Good, reach back, grab the chair, grab the uh, chair and lift the chest. Take a couple deep breaths. One more. All right, and two more breaths here. Inhale, reach up and exhale. Inhale, reach up and exhale. Namaste. Everybody have a great day. Um, thanks for joining me again. Uh, we're gonna do a little Tai Chi here if you wanna stick around.